Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is, well, me, Kim.、Um, so, let me just talk about my chicken manure. I think I also bought some steer manure, also. But、uh, this is great for your irises here. It says all purpose soil amendment add organic matter to your loosened, heavy soil. So, what I do with this, I actually lay it on my garden like this. And what's happening is that you see these little holes there is in the bag.、Um, over time, the worm will go through and go inside your soil, and it will create、um, a lot of,、um, break down a lot of.、Um, Amendments and stuff in there. So basically, you have to buy these soil, chicken manure, and steer manure. And you can do like I do you can line your garden or your bed.、Um, just let's say if you wanted to open up this iris bed bigger and you have、uh, a lot of grass or whatever growing underneath this area. So, what you want to do is you lined it. To the border, and that way the、um, grass doesn't grow up, and you don't have to worry about you know digging it up because, as this sitting here like this, it will also help your soil and it will be like very, very good once the 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 chicken manure kind of like incubate for six months. Why do we need to age the chicken manure for six months? Well, if you age it for six months, the、um, worm and everything else will go inside, break down the organic matter, and it's not going to be too toxic for your plant. Because if you take it home right away at Home Depot or at Lowe's or anywhere you go and you automatically put it into the,、uh, into the ground, what is going to happen is that it's going to burn your irises and it's going to burn your plant and it's going to burn the rhizome. So you don't want to do that either. With that being said, when I bought the soil, what I normally would do is I let it age for six months. Once I let it age for six months, then I will just automatically cut open the bag and I will just take a hole or a shovel and I just plop the soil into my plant. And once I did all that, plopping it into my、uh, flower bed, I don't really have to move too much, like physically moving the、um, bag anywhere. But it does make a lot of it's, it's messy, right? Because you're walking on it and whatever. But it's okay. It's okay if you're walking on it because it needs to lay and it needs to sit for six months. Otherwise, your plants is gonna hate you <laughs> if you just directly go in and basically、um, saying, I'm just gonna throw these manure in to amend my soil. You have to let it age for six months. If you don't let it age for six months, what's gonna happen is that these organic matters is gonna be too strong for the soil. So, again, I lined it up next to my garden, my bed. Also, it's helped me with the weed control. And also, when you water the plant, you water your plant. It, Sometimes drip back out by having the plastic bag here, it will help the water to stay in your garden bed and it will you will save water while you are watering your plant. So, this is the reason why I have my chicken manure sitting right here. Number one, it's weed control, number two, it's allow. The worm and other creatures to get into the little hole from the bag, and it will actually amend the actual soil that I have for it. 
So it it serves a lot of purposes. Number one, it's keeping the actual flower bed uh, from eroding, like coming out. Uh, the 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 old soil might come flying out of the flower bed. Number two, weed control. Number three, is that when I'm ready to use it, all I have to do is slide open with the the knife, and basically I go in and I flop the the. It would probably take me less. It was less than a couple of seconds to just amend the soil for my my bed, and as you know, I'm extremely busy because I have so much going on. And this, I found this works best right now. The price of the chicken manure has increased. Last year it was two dollars and ninety-seven cents. This year is four dollars and ninety-seven cents. You can use steer manure as well. Steer manure. Um, I like chicken manure more because chicken manure is um, it, 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 my iris loves it. But the steer manure, it's good for fruit plant or very established plant, not loosely rooted plant like irises. So basically, I love my chicken manure. But the steer manures are good for like um, trees. Um, the established root plant, um, such as citrus plant, and the steer manure, the price has not gone up. It's uh, still at like three ninety seven, whereas the chicken manure has gone up a lot. With that being said, I hope this tip help with amending your uh, soil for your garden. Also, by having these bags here, um helps you know remind you that okay in six months time that would be a little bit cold and um, you would need to basically uh, work on emitting the soil so you can plant your new flower um, rhizomes or bulbs or whatnot and plant so with that being said I bought it this month so that means at the end of September I can go ahead and um, use these chicken manure and then I can plant my new irises that I have in my uh, that I order or uh, being shipped to me so this is the, what I do for my flowers irises and all kind of fruit trees and plant so basically I bought like six bags of chicken manure and I bought like five bags of steers manure and all of these manure because it is strong in scent and it is strong in amendments what we need to do is we need to age them the steer manure I aged it for um eight months or uh, nine months the chicken manure I age it for six months sometime if I'm in a hurry I would only age all manures for six months but generally the steer manure it's more uh, I would say need to age a little bit longer because the longer you age uh, the longer you age it the warm it's actually going to um have elixir in the um, in the uh, bag for you now also by you know stepping on it you also like compress it down a little bit so that way it uh, helps builds moistures and compact the soil once you are um, going to start using it so anything to help your plants is the goal here and um, on top of that, these bags, they're like five, mm, I don't know, they're like three pounds. To me, they're a little bit heavy. So by doing, having them sit in the sun and having them aged like this and having walking on them and having to do little things like I'm doing, it really helps out with your back. So that way you don't have to move. You only need to move the bag once or twice, maybe from the store to the lawn. And basically, this is what I do. And I, I felt like it's easier and 
is better than having to uh, move everywhere now it does look a little bit cluttery but you know it is what it is gardening is a little bit messy and if you can't deal with it then you can't be a good gardener at the end of the day who has the biggest bloom the prettiest bloom is better right <laughs> well thank you so much for wasting about 10 minutes to watching my video and listen to my rant about my chicken and steer manure but please do it so that way your plants and flower will love you